In this meditation, we are focusing on opening flow within the energetic body and the energy that runs through the pillar of who we are, the chakra system. And so we're strengthening the chakras by opening a flow of energy so that as things come up, the energy keeps a steady movement. There is power when the river is flowing strong rather than it being at a stagnant place. And so we're opening flow in the chakras so that as all the things coming up in the collective, as well as your individual energetic past or history, anything that you may be holding on to, it opens the floodgates for it to be released. And all of the releasing is happening through the heart. And so if you can close your eyes at this moment and picture your chakras, you have your first chakra, which is the root chakra. And in this meditation, we are working with the 3D chakras. So we are first transforming and transmuting the energy of the 3D chakras in order to open up into the 5D chakra system and make the transition into the 5D physical form a little bit smoother and easier for you. So we first have the first chakra, which is the root chakra. It's located at the root of the spine, the base of the spine, but it also runs up from the feet through the legs to meet at the base of the spine. And then we have the sacral chakra, which is a little bit above the root chakra, very much connected to the umbilical cord, your belly button area. And then we have the solar plexus chakra, the third chakra, which is the gut area above the umbilical cord, if you place your hands just below your chest. And then we have the heart chakra, which is located at the heart, the chest area. And then we have the throat chakra located at the throat, the neck. And then we have the third eye chakra located at the brow, the center of the brow, the forehead. And then we have the crown chakra, which is located at the top of the head, the crown of the head. And so we're going to be working with these chakras in this meditation and opening flow in our energetic centers so that we can strengthen the way that energy moves through us so that we can become a greater and stronger pillar of light. The heart is acting as a powerful filtration system in your energetic body at this time. Everything is ultimately filtering through the heart and so the energy runs up from the ground, all of that grounding planetary energy is moving up through your feet and your legs and your root chakra and your sacral chakra and your solar plexus chakra and meeting at the heart where it's then released and expressed through the heart. At the same time, you have higher vibrational, non-physical energy from higher realms of light that is entering your physical form through your crown chakra. So it's entering your physical form through the crown chakra and filtering through your third eye chakra, down through the throat chakra and meeting at the heart. And from there, that energy is then opened up and expressed and released through the heart at the same time. This is a powerful filtration system because it's opening everything up. And the purpose of opening everything up is so that you have an open system to receive light. And so if you close your eyes, just visualize that filtration system of energy moving through your physical form, receiving that grounding energy from the planet up through your feet and your legs and your root chakra and your sacral chakra and your solar plexus chakra and meeting at the heart and the greater non-physical, higher vibrational light energy moving in through the crown and the third eye and the throat meeting at the heart you are opening that energy to be expressed through the heart, to open through the heart, to be released through the heart. For a lot of people who hold lower vibrational energy, especially in those lower chakras that's being released at this time, especially the root and the sacral and the solar plexus, all that past historical things of trauma and fear, it's all being released at this time through the heart. And so you may feel the overwhelming energy in the heart of that fear and trauma, but understand that it's coming up in order to be released. And so 
This is a lesson in learning how to move with the flow of energy, move with the ebb and flow, meaning if you feel that fear and trauma coming up, then it's okay, it's completely okay. Embrace it with an open heart, because it's only with an open heart that that fear and trauma can be released. And it's not that you're holding on to it as it comes up and as you embrace it, but it, you're embracing it so that you can then let it go. You can let it go with light and love. Remember to take deep breaths in through the nose at the count of four, holding it at the top and exhaling through the mouth with the count of five, holding it at the bottom. Feel that flow of energy like waterfalls moving upward from the root and downward from the crown, meeting at the heart and flowing out, flowing out, flowing out. And feel the water flowing through you. And if it helps, visualize yourself standing underneath a waterfall and feel that clear, crystal clear water moving through you. At this time as well, you can put your hands on your heart just to comfort and embrace the heart for all that it's doing for you in terms of filtering all of this energy out. Embrace your heart, love your heart, and care for your heart. I am the greater part of me. I embrace my physical form, but at the same time I release my physical form in the ways that it no longer serves me. I understand that I'm moving into a higher vibrational version of me, and in that transition I must release and let go of things that no longer serve me. I embrace this transition between my 3D form and my 5D form. I acknowledge that this process will not be easy, but I accept the ebb and flow. I move with the flow of how my divine inner being will move through me in order to help me align to the highest vibrational version of me. I embrace these changes. I embrace this transition. I embrace the shifts that I am moving through. I breathe in and out. I ebb. I flow. I release. I integrate. I activate. I move with the energy, trusting in each step along the way. In each now moment, I trust that I am connecting more deeply, more in alignment with, more balanced and in flow with my divine inner being, so that I am always being divinely guided and led in the direction of me integrating with the highest version of my highest self. I am the vessel, I am embodying my highest self, my highest divine inner being to be expressed through me in the way of light, in the way of love, and in the way of divine purpose. Continue taking deep breaths in through the nose with the count of four and holding it at the top and exhaling out through the mouth at the count of five, holding it at the bottom. Now place your hands on your root chakra. Feel the warmth open from your hands entering into the root chakra. And as you do this, you bring your focus to the root chakra, opening light, opening love, embracing it with acceptance, forgiveness, love, and grace. Take a deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. 
opening light in the root chakra. We're holding the space in the root chakra for all of the changes to occur, for all of the shifts that will happen and the transformation that the root chakra is going through. We open the space of light and love. And now move your hands over to your sacral, right over your umbilical cord, your belly button. Feel the warmth of your hands open into your sacral energy. Breathe in through the nose, opening up that belly, and out through the mouth. Feel the expansion and contraction of the belly. Open the muscles, stretch those muscles. Feel the warmth of the hands move through the belly. Move through that sacral energy, opening light and love in that sacral energy in that space, we're opening up space. Most of all, we're holding space for the sacral to go through the transformation and the transmutation and the shifts and the activation and integration that it's going through at this time. We're releasing so much past energy, so much energy of our lineage, of our bloodline, of our ancestors, of our collective, our history. And we hold space of love and oneness and light for all of these changes to move through with ease and grace. We open the space for energy to move. We do not meet it with resistance, but we meet it with love and compassion and acceptance. We honor it, we honor it, we honor it. We are where we are because of our past. We are learning, we are expanding, we are exploring. And so we open this space with ease and grace and allow for the flow of energy to meet ease and grace and love and light as it moves through us to be released. And now place your hands over your solar plexus chakra, right under the chest, and breathe in through the nose and hold it at the top and out through the mouth and hold it at the bottom. Continue to breathe in and out. Feel the warmth of the hands open into the solar plexus. And here we're going to open a protective layer around the solar plexus. Imagine a bright golden white light surrounding the solar plexus, opening up a space that feeds source energy directly into the solar plexus. This is almost like a womb of energy that we are encapsulating the solar plexus in, in order to regenerate, heal, and repair itself to strengthen itself in this bubble of 5D source light energy. And so feel that solar plexus encapsulated in a womb of bright golden white light fed directly by source energy, knowing that all is well, and so it is. And now move your hands up to your heart and feel the warmth of your hands open space into the heart, meeting it with love and compassion and ease and grace and flow. Open doors, visualize doors opening so that the heart opens and allows all the energy meeting at the heart to be expressed and released and released and released without resistance, but with openness and flow. And so you meet your heart with compassion and you embrace your heart with love and light and you honor and you appreciate and offer gratitude to your heart and the powerful job that it's doing for you at this time. Now you move your hands to your crown, placing your hands on top of your head, the crown of your head. Feel the warmth of your palms opening warmth and light in through the head. 
Imagine light opening that crown and bringing energy, pulling energy into the crown of the head. Receiving all the non-physical source light energy in through the crown. Opening, opening, opening. Receiving, receiving, receiving. And making the intention of receiving this higher vibrational energy in alignment, in perfect alignment, in perfect tuning and in perfect timing with where your physical form is at this now moment. You may or may not be in the place to receive this higher vibrational source light to integrate well with your physical form, but it will unpackage and unfold for you and integrate within you and activate within you in perfect timing and in perfect alignment with the transformation that your physical form is going through. And so you open space in the crown area to filter that source light, high vibrational energy into the physical form in perfect timing and perfect unfolding. And you trust that all is truly well. And now you place your palms over your third eye and feel the warmth, open space in the third eye. Open the window into seeing a world with new light and new eyes. You open space that peels back the layers of that pineal gland to help you see with clear eyes and a clear lens, to help you see with the eyes of source and with the eyes that can see a 5D reality. And you hold space for this transformation and these shifts of the third eye and the pineal gland to open and unfold in perfect timing and in perfect alignment to the transition that your physical form is taking. And then you place your hands over your throat chakra and feel the warmth of the palm of the hands flow into the throat chakra. And you open space for the throat to open so that when your physical form is aligned to that which is your divine inner being, that which is your higher self expressed through you, you have the ability to express your inner truth through your throat chakra, opening it up to share with the world and to share with others in truth, in grace, in love, and in divine light, honoring your greater soul's mission, your greater soul's purpose, and you in alignment with your divine inner being. We open space of love and light in the throat chakra to unfold your expression of your inner truth and your expression of your divine inner being in alignment with your physical form and you being this vessel so that all may be opened up in perfect timing, in perfect alignment, and in perfect unfolding. Now hold your hands at your heart once again to meet at the heart and open the heart even more as the waterfall of energy meets at the heart from the higher chakras and the lower chakras meeting and gaining momentum at the heart to express and open 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 through the heart we hold a space of love and openness in the heart and take a deep breath in through the nose at the count of four, hold it at the top. And exhale through the mouth. At the count of five, hold it at the bottom. And continue to breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. bring your hands together at the heart in namaste breathing in through the nose at the count of four holding it at the top and exhaling through the mouth at the count of five holding it at the bottom following a torus or a toroidal field movement Open your namaste hands upward, up through the throat, the third eye, the crown, 
up above the crown, open the hands up to reach above the head and around the body, opening up the hands as far as you can reach outward, reaching into your energetic auric field, opening around you slowly and downward, downward until your hands meet again at the root chakra, palms together. And now bringing your hands up again in that toroidal torus field movement, upward from the root to the sacral, to the solar plexus, palms together, fingers facing down, moving the palms upward to meet at the heart, fingers now facing upward, again at namaste position at the heart. And you can continue that movement a couple more times, the palms together, reaching upward, up through the upper chakras, the throat, the third eye, the crown, reaching up to the sky, opening those hands, and now sweeping it around the body, through your energetic auric field, stretching the hands out, stretching the arms out, moving it downwards, downwards, slow, slow, slow. Feeling the energy as you move your hands through your energy field, and it meets together at the root chakra, palms together, fingers facing down, and now sweep the energy up through that column of your chakra center from the root to the sacral, to the solar plexus, palms still together, fingers facing down, and now rotate it at the heart. So fingers are now facing upward at the heart, palms together in namaste position. Taking deep breaths and one more time, do that toroidal field energy flow with your palms and your hands feeling the energy slowly. You're sweeping the energy of your auric field and opening flow, taking deep breaths in through the nose and out through the mouth. And come back around to namaste position at the heart. And do it one more time on your own. And when you reach the namaste position, once again at the heart, just take a bow in appreciation and gratitude. Thank you so much for practicing this guided visual meditation with me. Thank you to our inner divine guidance for all of the activations and powerful integration and flowing of energy, opening of energy throughout our physical form and our energetic form that just took place in this meditation. And so it is.